What's up everyone? Welcome to the stream. My name is the Vitsi9 and we are back playing Nino Kuni Wrath of the White Witch. We are um not that far in, just got the ship. But uh happily moving towards that goalpost. Happily but slowly. So we can get all the Pokemon, Pokemains in the, in the way. <laughs> How are you all doing? Hope you're doing great. How was your uh, how was your day off, Cyan? Your your Sunday. Your Sunday is today. How was your Sunday? <laughs> Where are you playing these days? Do I know? Oh, you finished control, right? Did you start something else? Hey Metal, how are you? Got the first vaccine for COVID today, nice, nice. How are you feeling? Fine, no funny business? That's good, that's good. I don't even know if I'm on a list. I assume everyone is, but... My arm aches a bit. It's like getting a tetanus shot. Okay. I'm a little light on my tetanus shots. <laughs> I, I don't really remember. Trying to get this Rhino thing. Because I don't think I have that one. Still trying to catch Pokemon or the Pokeballs instead of Ultra Balls. Mm -hmm. Yes. Man, I just feel the craving to have things completed, man. You don't get it. You 
I get it, but I would do it the smart way. <laughs> but I only know that there's another way because you told me. So, this is the way. This is the way for for doing it now. Have you tried using the other Pokémon yet? I've changed around between a few. But, um... But, like, Warrior style is definitely my favorite. The guy with the sword and shield. If I max out this guy, I'll get, like, a cat or something. Max out this guy says dude farming Pokemon 1 XP minions. He's level 26. I mean, there was another one that um, maxed out at 11, so it's definitely possible. There was one that was just like. Hey, level 11 is the max for this Pokemon. Now go, go get fucked. Going to grab a snack? Okay, I'm going to do something stupid. Rest in force. Thank you. Just gonna watch your rest. <laughs> hey, the side quest directed me here. It can't be that bad. Or maybe it can. Who knows? Just hit him. There's one more attack. Not a lot of XP. You sure the side quest sent you there? The side quest sent me to the entrance of this area, yeah. I, I fought a guy in that archway there. It's okay, man. I'll... I, I've saved... Don't worry about it. What is Esther doing?
Yeah, this, this does seem a little hardcore. Appears to be securely locked. Uh, well. I love going to places before I should. I hate it when it's just. Oh, it's locked. Go away. She doesn't have any MP. About to be overpowered? That's fine. I like being overpowered. the creatures at sea change. Potty? Does he want to go potty? I was just barely paying attention. 
One more Pokemon. They have really bad names. Jack Potty. Hey, that looks like an attack that would heal. Everyone in the arena. What happened to my item? What the hell are you doing? Stop cancelling my attacks! Why does, why does the fact that he does something interrupt what I'm doing? Not overpowered yet, clearly. It's the first time I did that. Ok, 
bacana. I don't appreciate the random encounters on the sea, because I can't explore freely. Fighting him. At zero MP. Maybe that's the idea. Yeah, but it's dumb. I, I'm just saying I don't like the idea. Let me explore. If I go to an area and the enemies overpower me, that's fine. Not even being able to get there. No. No. Also, the idea of a vehicle is to avoid the random uh, battles. Get that! He doesn't give time for my defending to come back. Dokrome! 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 Dokr
待機は出ないだぞもしかしてさっきのジャボーの魔法間違いないでしっかりつかまれるあの目に睨まれたらおしまいだもう睨まれてるって It's the invincible. Remember Final Fantasy IX? Thank goodness. Oh, everybody's here. But where's P? E? She's not here. What's he on about? Oi, are you alive or what? Oh, you are back with us at last. Captain. Heh, <laughs> looks like it'll take more than a gust of wind to keep you down. Anyway, enough of the soppy stuff. Captain, is the ship in a fit state to sail? Alas, she's not. The storm took a heavy toll on my beloved sea cow. Even with all hands on double shifts, repairs will take at least one week. What? That's ages. Ah, we must be the unluckiest people alive. Do not say such things. That we are alive at all makes us luckier than any who have faced the eye of the storm before. He's right. We were extremely lucky to survive. I bet it was because we had Oliver on our side. Me? But I didn't do anything. Do you think it was me? Anyway, it doesn't matter. I couldn't beat Shadar. Couldn't save Alicia. You speak of things unknown to me. But is it not enough that you are alive and well? He's right, Oliver. Come on, cheer up. I, I'll try. Thanks. Good. Now, Captain, what can we do to help? Oh, I appreciate your fire, young lady. But you must leave the work to we men of the sea. And it looks like we're on holiday. I suppose a few days of sunbathing wouldn't hurt. Typical. Hmm? Has anybody seen Mr. Drippy? Now that you mention it, no. You don't think he's been washed away, do you? Oh no, look! Mr. Drippy, are you okay? Hmm? What? Oh, what's that? What do you mean? Hmm? I'm fine. Of course I am. Did you hit your head when we washed ashore or something? You're acting like a right weirdo. Oh, what are you on about, man? Is the boat fixed? Tell me it's fixed. Come on, let's get off this smelly old rock. It's nowhere near fixed, and you know it. Come on, we need to keep ourselves occupied. Shall we have a look around the island? Eh? Hey. No, I mean, why would you want to do that? Boring, it is, deserted, I shouldn't wonder, and dangerous too, perilous even. Let's just stay by here and enjoy the view, shall we? Ah, there's beautiful, yeah, nice. Ah, of course. Friends, we will soon run short of provisions. Perhaps you could go in search of sustenance for ourselves and our shipmates? Of course, Captain. It's the least we can do. Great! Come on, everyone, let's go! No, man! Wait, man! You can't, man! Didn't you hear me? It's dangerous! You'll be eaten a flipping alive! Look, fairy, I'm not mad keen myself, but we don't have much choice. We'll just have to grin and bear it, okay? Mm, pants! <laughs> The swirling violence at the heart of the storm has unlocked a story in the Wizard's Companion. Okay.
What's up, pants boy? <laughs> Hello, bro. How are you? Come on, Oliver. Let's have a look around the island. So that was Shadar, huh? And we couldn't beat him. Beat him? We never stood a chance. We'll have to do a damn sight better than that next time. In fact, we're going to have to go all out. All out? Yeah, going all out is a good way to change your tactics when you spot an opportunity or get into trouble during a fight. Press triangle to switch to all out attack and square to switch to all out defense. That should make things a little easier. Maybe you do know a thing or two after all. Of course I do. The old man has a pretty strict teach. Uh, I, uh, right, let's go. Was a pretty strict teach. Throw! Complaining about things works. Not only did Sony bring back the old. The, not, uh. not do the, the things. But, I complained live about not having gotten a way out. It arrived today. <laughs> Happy holidays, Davy. Congrats. Excuse me? What are we talking about? What holidays? I heard about the Sony thing. This is your caveman Christmas, isn't it? Yes, yes it is, yes it is. <laughs> but I got a way out! Wow. Well, we had to complain about it on the on a stream, huh? Tell you, man, this ain't a good idea. They're already running from me. What? Sure, Tuna Customs heard your complaints. Well, uh, I didn't get any th anything from Customs. But whoever sent me that lied. Because, um... <laughs> There was a customs declaration saying it only cost 14 pounds. You could say a way out, found its way out, I'll see myself out. Wow. Classy. Always classy. <sighs> hey, I'm happy it arrived. And I'm happy they lied about it too. So at least I don't have to pay any extra at customs. Bitch. A fish burger in a lost chest. That's gotta be good. Hmm? 
Oh, I didn't see that at all. I don't know what's in that green treasure chest. I bet I could crack it open if I tried. I see you got familiars with you. I do give... You do give them the hot treat, don't you? Offer them their favorite and they'll snap your claw off. And it'll help them grow stronger, too. Just in case you're wondering, there's no treat I like more than a nice, juicy, dumb flounder. I wasn't wondering. Pinch me if I'm dreaming, but are you a human? We don't get many humans in this cave. Well, there's not a great deal to do here, but I hope you have a cracking time anyway. Time for Blizzard Frango. How far, uh, what chapter are you in? Got a ship, have you? Well, just watch out for sea monsters, alright? They hide themselves under the waves, you see. You just don't know what you're up against until it's too late. Hey, listen to this. I heard that there's an island far to the west of here that's always covered with thick fog. None of us crabs go anywhere near the place, of course. The monsters over there are savage. We'd be toast in no time. Still chapter one, I think. Okay, okay. Taking your time. Chapter one is by far the longest, anyway. Seeing you reminds me of those other humans who washed up here. Oh, a good while ago now. I overheard them talking about how they'd found the cave jam-packed with creatures on another island. I'd have asked them where, only they weren't capable of understanding the simplest of claw gestures. Humans, eh? Oh, no offense. Yeah, yeah. First chapter takes longer because you explore everything. It makes I I uh, normal I think. See, I told you I had the biggest pincers. What are you on about? Mine are much bigger. Oh, you were cracking a joke, right? Funny, like your tiny claws. All right, have fun. Well, well, it's not every day we get a visit from a human. You better mark this momentous occasion by giving you a bit of advice. I suppose you found a shield or two on your travels, have you? Well, I'm told, don't ask by who, that if you equip your familiars with shields, there's a chance they'll block enemy attacks automatically. And get this, shields that have a low defense rating might actually be better for automatic blocking. Worth bearing in mind, I'd say. That sounds interesting. Ah, oh, 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 ah, this is just, oh, cracking. What? And that's the David soundboard for porn. Whatever. These names are so dumb.
rings a bell. Well, 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 well. Oh, pants, this won't be pretty. Huh? W what's. Oh, well, if it ain't my little drapey, where have you been then? Off gallivating, I bet, without a word to your old man the whole time. You'll be the death of me, you will. M Mr. Drippy, I think she's talking to you. Can't be, Mon. I have no idea who she is. Oh, there's Scruel. Why are you back anyway, Drippy? Find that human you were looking for, did you? Supposed to be some sage or something, was it? wasn't it? No, Marn, alright? I haven't found her yet. Don't you mind me, you'd have found her ages ago if you weren't such a lazy beggar. And after all I did for you. Oh, hello there. What's that you got with you then? Who's that who you got with you then? Uh, oh, um, are you talking to me, ma'am? Proper little gentleman this one, ain't it? Oh, but look at the state I'm in. I've just woken up, mon. Why didn't you tell me we had visitors, drippy boy? Come on, holy boy, like it. Hey, here. You got a map, haven't you? I'll take a look at the top right-hand corner. I've marked it for you, ain't it? That's where I am, see? Come and see me, alright? I'm sorry, ma'am. We have to go now. Chop, chop, mon. What? Taco. Cheapers, a village all the way out here. <laughs> Look at that. What a funny little house. Is that supposed to be an octopus or something? Pants! Now I'm flipping for it. Oi, look at that, man. Look at what, man? I'm flipping busy, ain't I? You, busy? Don't make me laugh. Look, man, humans! Eh, hey, where to, man? Crikey, it is and all. Flipping humans, man! I've never seen one before. Proper weird looking, ain't I? And I thought one drippy was bad enough. Look at them all. Are they all fairies too? Flipping heck, man. It's only flipping drippy, boy. You're right, man. Drippy, man. What are you doing back, the, back by him there? Hmm. <clears throat> How do you do, boys? How do, boys? Long time no see. Drippy boy? Hang on, is this? Yeah, alright, man, yes, it is, okay. Welcome to the fairy ground, forest of the fey folk, and land of my fathers. Well, mothers, really, but. What? No way! A totally tidy town! <laughs> oh man, I love this one. <laughs> so that's why you've been acting so shifty? Right oh boys, just drop by to say hello, ain't it? That's done now, so tidy, catch you next time. Nah, man, you can't go to can't go going just like that. What are you on about, man? You've only just got home. You ain't even seen mom yet. Ain't it though? Come on. We'll take you over there. Going that way anyway, weren't we boys? There's no need, boys. Seriously, lay off, man. Oi, stop it, you lot. Ah, holy boy, help! Pants, help! So that's what's been making him behave so strangely. Yep, I almost feel sorry for our little lantern-nosed friend. Huh, what do you mean? <laughs> From the look of it, I'd say Drippy doesn't enjoy visiting his mother very much. Hmm, but why not? 
Anyway, we can't leave him in the clutches of a gang of unruly fairies, can we? Let's get after them. Okay, let's go. <laughs> I'm in. I wouldn't miss a chance to see the Lord High Lord of the Big Mouth squirm if you paid me. Don't be so mean. Drippy got carried away. Nino Kuni. Hello, Nirva. How are you? See all these signs on the stalls and shops and that? They're lit up by magic, ain't it? You won't see that nowhere else. Man, unique it is. Travelers, is it? Have fun. It's nice around here and that. What do you reckon? I'm the official town greeter. Bet I made you feel proper special there, didn't I? You ain't seen the fairground till you've seen the great big giant lady up the end of town. You won't believe your eyes, man. Hmm. How's it going, Irva? I'm, uh, perfidiously sorry, but we ain't open yet. Careful you don't become the talk of the town, man. <laughs> How do I avoid that? You played this before? Nah, uh, oh. you seemed excited to see it. <laughs> so I thought you had played it. It is nice. I'm enjoying it a lot. Damn, there's so many characters to talk to. Not much into weeb stuffs. Hmm. It's not that weeb. There's not just food stalls around here, you know? We got one of them hoodie shops. The swift one. The crow one. The whole shebang. Just look at the roof. Ain't it? The signs will tell you which one's which. This is King We here. Uh, no, he's uh, he's playing a game. He's lurking, I think. Welcome to Switch Solutions, where those in need come to watch their worries. Ooh, be a be a hasty retreat. There are no side quests, though. Ah, there's nothing like getting out of the house and having a bit of me time away from all my troubles. I don't even have none. Na ha 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 ha. Ah, there's lovely, a little human boy come to visit us. Careful around by here, mind. There's some proper dodgy characters about. Mainly me. Yuck, 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 yuck. I know the fairy ground's famous for food and funnies mainly, but it's got more to offer than that, you know. The air around by here is clean as a whistle, and the night sky is enough to blow your tiny mind. If you fancy seeing a bit of fairy comedy, how it's supposed to be done, get yourself over to the Cavity Club. It's just down the way there. A stunning example of ancient fairy architecture it is. Give or take all the bits they replaced the other week, which was most of them. <laughs> well. You want to sit down, is it? Right out. Wait a sec. I'll just bunch up for you. Make a bit of room. Like, no? Ah, fine. Sit yourself. 
Just me, the thing every comedy duo needs is a nice, thick sidekick. The stupider, the better. Huh? Uh, a clever streak, man. The quicker he is, the better. Hmm. Give over, man. I can't eat no more. I'm flipping stuffed. Oh, visitors, is it? Tidy, sit down, sit down. Let me get you a nice bowl of slug stew or three. Hmm, who's that, eh? Oh, who do? Who can I help you? Help who, who die? I reckon if I scrimps on a few ingredients here and there, I can up my profits by a tidy bit. Mega bucks, here I come. Hum. Oh, don't mind me, man. Just practicing my lines for uh, the panto, hey, ain't it? The panto? What the hell's the panto? I'm no Billy, no mates. I just like eating solo, ain't it? Helps you really concentrate on the flavors and that. Proper sophisticated I am, see? My dough's gone proper bouncy lately. Reckon it must be that new shampoo I got. Crikey, the sauce by here is proper tasty. I wonder what they put in it. Hmm. Car, a flapping customer. I don't mean to be crude, but every one of our items is a flapping cocker. Whoa. No one can use this? Another news, the city hall in my city is opening up some jobs. I'm going to apply to some. Oh, nice. Like what kind? jobs? Um, uh, it's like janitor? What? Uh, yeah, isn't it? Yeah. Tourism specialists. Do you need a tourism degree, I guess? Oh, you could go for the computer engineer, too. Huh? 
like a nerd. <laughs> also trying the engineer one, yeah. One for law, where are they? What are they looking for in law? Just wondering. Oh, it doesn't... it's not de a detailed thing, huh? Just didn't check because you don't have a law degree, that makes sense. Metal law should be a thing. Yes. Your music deserves to be sent to jail. City Hall uh, Law Specialist? Okay. Can I choose my outfit? No. Switch? I can. No, I can't. What is this good for? I even have a bathing suit for Swain, I haven't even seen it. This guy has 19 evasion. Oh. 
Go around. Roll up, roll up. Crikey, you and there's unusual. What's that red thing on your back? Makes you fly, does it? Only if someone punches me really hard. Eats more than anybody else in this whole forest by here. I eat more than anybody else in this forest by here. Keep it coming, Chief. I ain't nowhere near finished yet. <laughs> Them three twins are flipping legends, man. Flip, man. Why do you have to walk me so flipping hard? I'm your sidekick, not your flipping punch bag. The harder I wallop you, the louder they laugh, ain't it? It's pretty flipping funny from where I'm standing. Yuck, yuck, yuck. But yeah, Metal, I, I hope that uh, that goes well, man. When are you applying? Nice to see you. God, you're supposed to say, to see you, nice, ain't it? Flip, man, can't get the blooming sidekicks these days. What's the due date for this? Eat our food, it's all tasty and that. There's a green chest everywhere, right? I just have to look for it. For the school ministers, I'll send the form and CV and some other stuff ASAP, because the school one ends the 21st, okay. The engineer ends on the 28th. Alright. Yeah. What a busy place. Already filled out the form, nice. <laughs> That's so fucking cute. 
My goodness, she's enormous! So, this is Mr. Drippy's mom? <laughs> Need to scan my ID, my school diploma, and other documents. Send everything to Human Resources email. Okay. Dude, state job, man. That would be amazing. Well, she certainly makes a big imp first impression. I'll give her that. Lovely girl. Fairy godmother? She was... Where is she, eh? Probably just left her somewhere, didn't you? There's terrible. And to think you're a son of mine. Who would be so good? Cool schedule. Cool benefits. Yeah, man. Just look at your nose, man. You should turn that thing off once in a while, you little wastrel. Cost you a fortune, it will. I don't charge myself for using it, do I? Flip, man. And I told you, I told you already, we're looking for Alicia, ain't it? Me and the young lad I was telling you about, you never listened to me, man. Oh, you are, are you? There's kind of you. Mm -hmm. Suddenly she's listening. Are you deliberately trying to wind me up or something, honestly? Oh, how oh, there's lovely. What is it now, Mon? You're looking very slim these days, love. What are you on about, Mon? I'm exactly the same as last time you flipping saw me. You're just saying things for the sake of it now. I am not proper podgy you were. Not surprising considering how much you used to put away. Little Lord Lard, I used to call it you. <laughs> wow. Shut up, Mon. Oh, uh, hello. Who's this then, eh? Eh? Oh, it's you, holy boy. Took your time, didn't you? Oh, you're the little dears who've been going around with my drippy, is it? Now, which one of you is the poor-hearted one? It's the pure-hearted mon. P-P-U-R-E. I'm the flipping poor one, having you for a mother. Uh, I, uh, nice to meet you, man. Are you Mr. Drippy's mother? That's right, my lovely, for my sins. Oh, ain't he just adorable? Oh, while I remember. You keep familiars, ain't it, love? I got a few sweeties by here somewhere. Let me see now. Ah, there we are. Who? Cool. Thank you so much. Our familiars will be very happy. It's my pleasure, love. Oh, and while you're over by here, I've got something to ask you. You too. What is it, ma'am? Sorry to spring this on you out of the blue, like, but you wouldn't mind taking a look at my guts, would you? Huh? Crikey, you don't get much more out of the blue than that, man. Well, thank you to keep your clever comments to yourself. The night thought I told you to turn that flipping lantern, lantern off. Can't flipping turn it off, and it's none of your business what I do with it anyway. I'm a grown fairy. When you say take a look at your guts, what do you mean exactly? Do you mean you'd like us to... to... go inside you and... Uh, look for something? Something's funny. Something funny's going on here. Something I don't want any part of. Well, what is it, see? They're not coming out. Huh? They're not coming out. The littlies, I mean. I give birth to all of them, see? I'm the mother of all fairies, ain't it? And there's a load in there now who should have come popping out a while back. But nothing, not a peep. Desperate I am. I... I'm not sure I understand. Right, it's like this, see? My mom here brings up all the littlies. That's baby fairies to you, inside her tummy. Once they're big enough, out they pop. But it's so warm and comfy in there that sometimes the little darlings don't want to come out. I've heard some strange things in my time, but this is... this is... I, I don't know what this is. I know, love. It's proper strange them not coming out. He ain't talking about littlies, one. Anyway, the thing is, to get inside, mom, and see what's going on with littlies, there's a little something you have to do first. That's right. You gotta make me laugh, ain't it? What, what do you mean? The only way into mom's tummy is through her mouth, but it's so massive she can't keep it open long unless she's laughing her head off. 
So why don't you make her laugh, Mr. Drippy? Don't be stupid, Mon. I've been off the circuit for years. I'm very particular, see? New material only. And his set is as old as the flipping hills. So, we can help? Never mind. We didn't mean to come to the island anyway. We'll just leave it, shall we? No, we shall not. Drippy, we have to do something. You're right. Proper worried about those littlies I am. Let's go and look for someone who can make the old girl giggle, shall we? But how? I don't know anything about comedy. Well, there's a the famous theater over by the fairyground, where those fairies cut over the comic teeth. Called the Comedy Club, it is. And since I taught a couple of the boys down there everything they know, I reckon they'll be happy to help us in our hilarious mission. You taught them? This I have to see. All right, let's go find the Cavity Club. Thanks, lovelies. I'm cu counting on you, I am. Drapey's back. Well, that was something. A cup of joe. Oliver, it's you. Thank goodness you're here. What's wrong, Oris? I stowed away aboard the ship and cast away cuff, but when I woke up, I was here. Never knew there was a whole forest full of these little loonies. When did this happen? Why, you cheeky little beggar. The fairy ground here has been the center of fairy culture for centuries. Only centuries? Well, who wouldn't have been when here when I was on my travels then? Eh, hey, what are you on about? Nothing. Anyway, it may not be where I expected to see you next, but let's give you your next puzzle anyway, shall we? You're getting to be a pretty good wizard these days, Oliver. That means you must have a genie at your command. Genie? You mean alchemy? Sure I do. Good. Then this will be nice and easy for you. You've seen the formulae gathered by wizards over the years in the Wizard's Companion, haven't you? I often used to whip myself up an ice burger when I was on my travels. You did? Burgers are my favorite, too. Then you'll know just what that certain special something no burger can do without is, won't you? Do you know what I'm talking about? It's the one ingredient all burgers need. Let me know when you've worked it out. Bread? I thought these were all chemical form formulas. Welcome back, Metal. Sandwich. No. Crispy lettuce. That's right, the one ingredient no burger can do without is a nice portion of crispy lettuce. Burgers, eh? We used to have a burger place by here. You know, McDeer the Feeds, it was called. 
I used to love popping down there for a nice juicy muck rare bit. Wow, that does sound good. I'd love to try one. Me too. Wait, I just remembered something. What is it, Mon? It was another page from the wizard's companion I meant to give you, but I lost it somewhere. It was f for a funny little spell called Levitate. Maybe one of these fairies found it? Anyway, if you come across it, it's yours. Uh, thanks. That means I need to think of something else to give you for answering my question. Oh, I know, it was a question about alchemy after all. Here you go. New formula. Nice. It's the recipe for the Sage of Ages Super Special Mega Medicine. You should give it a try. It can cure anything. Right. I can't stay on the silent full of loonies any longer. I'm off to the next town. Maybe I'll hop on the back of one of those big sea beasts and ride over to the nearest continent. See you soon. This, uh, this is cheating. To talk to everyone again. What's wrong? Oh, uh, what the heck is that smell, man? It'll be the special, I reckon. Sausage and custard omelette. Gee, that sounds interesting. You could say that. Yeah, this one's going to be a toughie. Oh, listen to me, that's not my style. Bring it on, man, that's what I meant to say. Hmm? You're going to try it? Of course I am. There ain't a special I haven't tried yet, and there have been some proper weird ones and all. That's what I call brave. He's got courage coming out of his eyeballs. Sure does. Say, Mr. Fairy, would you mind sharing some of your courage with us? My courage, you say? Of course not. One, go for your life. You'd have to borrow a few bucketfuls before I notice the difference. Really? Gee, thanks. <laughs> Stop it, man, it tickles. In a nice way, though. What's wrong? You seem kind of tense. It's alright, man, just having a little bet with my buddy by mm, here. She would kind of bet. Uh, oh, we're seeing how long I can go without eating one of my beloved mm, lard pies. A little test of the old willpower, is it? Nice. How long have you been at it for? Mm, only five years. 227 days. 2 hours, 4 minutes, 16 seconds. Cheapers, creepers, you've really been doing it that long? That is some serious flipping restraint. Here, you've got a genuine talent there, man. Fancy sharing a bit of it with those who need it? Sharing it? Go on, then. What do I have to, uh, do? I don't have to do anything. Just hold still for one second. Is that it? Well, I won't lie. It sounds proper weird, but go on, mm, then. Thank you very much, Mr. Fairy, sir. about. Suddenly resisting the pull of the pies feels one heck of a lot easier. Tidy, is this your doing? Come on. Must have not been that great.
They seem happy. Crikey, another stinker. Well, if it ain't my old pals, Smiley and Surly. How do, boys? Drippy. How do, man? Long time no see, eh? Never mind the small talk. You pair of layabouts. What are you doing back by here? I sent you to spy on flipping Shadar, didn't I? Ah, well, you see, we, um, we just popped back home to get some cash to continue funding our, uh, espionage, ain't it now? We've been working our socks off, man. Got a tiny bit of info just the other day we did. See what this Shadar see? Well, he's... He's what, man? Spit it out. He's got all horns on his head, ain't it? Well, I know that, don't I? I've seen him in the flipping flesh. So the news you were getting while you were a doll, Mr. Trippy, it was from... He was... Oh, the news you were getting while you were a doll. That's right, Dolly Boy. Smiley and Surly were well, my eyes and ears on the ground. Training up some new talent, are you? How do? I'm Smiley from Smiley and Surly. They look a bit wet, man. This one by here looks like he'd pinch the dummy from a baby's mouth. What? You cheeky little. Don't take it personal, man. It's just his way. It's why they call him Surly, ain't it? Hmm. It's better than greening your face off all day like this gormless idiot by here. Anyway, nice to meet you and all that. It's nice to meet you too. Are these the fairies you said you trained, Drippy? Can we get them to help us make your mom laugh? Oh yeah, it's the least you can do after letting me down in your spying duties. You heard ma'am's all clogged up with lilies, ain't it? Is it? They're serious? We've not heard that, man. Hang on a minute, you two. Now I get it. What is it, Mr. Drippy? Well, it's like this, see? We've been here all this time and neither one of these two has cracked a single joke. It's worse than I thought, man. They're... They're broken-hearted. Huh? What? Ah, oh, so that's it. Is it, man? I was wondering what was up with us, like... Trust you to spot it, Drippy boy. Proper sharp-eyed you are. Hold on a second, does anyone have a clue what these lunatics are on about? Oh yeah, well, it's like this, see? We fairies' arts are made up of all different types of comedy. Pieces of art, we call them. You mean like the pieces of heart that humans... human hearts are made of? of? Well, it's not really the same, but if it helps you to think of it like that, fair enough. Anyway, when you lose a piece of heart, we become heartbroken, see? Just like when humans become heartbroken, you mean? Come on, what are you on about? Completely different, it is. Well, it doesn't sound like it. Heartbroken people just act all weird. Folks who get heartbroken have it much worse. Those, they stop being funny. I know, terrible, ain't it? Hmm, I don't think I quite understand. I get it. This means we're in trouble, right? Because we need to make your mom laugh. Make mom laugh? You're kidding, ain't you? We couldn't make Laffy Laffington laugh after a barrel of laughing gas, man. Sorry, no can do. He's right, man. We tried giving him a second barrel, but he sicked up, didn't he? Sad, really. We thought he was giggling at first. Flipping useless you are, the pair of you. Still, you are heartbroken, I suppose. All right, we'll help you. You will? Tiny, proper legend you are, drippy boy. If we don't get funny soon, we'll have to split up. Imagine, after 17 years. Hey, split up? That's the first time I'm flipping heard about it. You're right, Drippy. We should help them. Just like you and Oliver helped me. Tidy, that's that decided then. Let's get all the pieces of art together and give these boys a laugh injection, shall we? Nice one, Drippy boy. You don't want to see us split up, eh? What do you keep going on about splitting up for, man? We never said nothing about it. Right, holy boy, get your piece of art gathering hat on. I reckon eight should do it. Sound about right to you. Come on, let's do it. We can't let them split up. How many times, man? We're not flipping, splitting up. Eight? Hoy, little, you got a minute? Nah, man, I ain't. I got no more to do, ain't it? 
Homework? Ha! Pull the other one. Listen, you got any pieces of art to spare? No, nah, man, I ain't, man. I am... And I have got homework, honest. I'm supposed to grow these seeds by here, but they ain't so much sprouted. Not sprouted, eh? It looks like you need a bit of helping hand. Got anything to help your... You got anything up your sleeve that might do the trick, holy boy? <laughs> hey, Echo, how's it going? Flip, man! Look at that, man! Flew up, did it? Amazing! That's my homework done, man! Tidy! Ta, man! You saved me right ear bashing off, ma'am! Ma'am? Man? Ma'am? Pieces of art, was it? Here, ta! Ta to you too, Litley! Try to do your own homework next time, though, eh? Pretty decent, slowly getting ready for the end of the semester. You get, you have stuff to do again? Crikey, you still going, are you? Of course I am, man. There's life in the old fairy yet. Can I help you with something, Drippy Boy? As a matter of fact, you can. Got any pieces of art going, begging? How am I supposed to know? My cleaners run off, and I can't find Flippy anything. This floor ain't going to sweep itself now, is it? Ain't it? I wouldn't be so sure about that. What do you reckon, holy boy? Look at that, the broom's up and started moving all on its own. How did that? Never mind, I ain't looking a gift horse in the mouth. <sighs> what was that you said you were after, Trippy Boy? Pieces of art, was it? You're in luck. Look, there's this one down by here. Ha, ah, come to daddy. Ta, man. Echo doesn't relax. <gasps> He's Echo. Who are you then? <sighs> oh, did I ever end up in this nest of gnomes? Boy, who are you calling gnomes, you cheeky little flapper? Ah, you know how to give a girl a fright. How come you can understand me? Well, never mind. Since I serve so with you... Ooh. Unburdened myself to. Here, take this. One good turn deserves another, eh? Oh, you got the levitate spell. Ooh. Th thanks. Glad to be of service. Uh, is that a page from the Wizard's Companion for a spell called levitate? Why would a Steagle be carrying a spell that makes you float? It's obvious, ain't it? He likes a bit of light reading. Boom, boom! Cheapers. Think I might take some shifts on line math tutoring? Oh, if it's good money, man. Of course. How do? You alright? I need a piece of heart or two. Man, you got any? Long time no see, Dreepy Boy. No pieces of art around by here, man. Ain't had much to laugh about lately, see? Oh, come. What's up? Well, got these horns on my head, ain't it? And lately they've got a hell of a long, and now they're proper heavy, killing my neck, they are. Hear that, holy boy? Sounds like a job for spellcasting superheroes such as your fine young self. Oh. 
ते I'm not rewinding time for it. That's too heavy and it, you need to make it lighter, you know, make it float, clean off its shoulders, like... Do I not have this spell? Okay. Crikey, feels like a weight's been lifted off my shoulders. Horns? You feel more like flipping feathers, light as they are. Nice one, drippy boy. Here, have that piece of art you were after. Tidy, Tom on! How do, man? Meowsers, drippy boy. How long has it been? This is, uh, practically unheard of. Blimey, you're chirpy. Listen, you got some... got something to ask you. I have... You got any pieces of art? Tono, man, I've been feeling the cold so bad lately, I've not had a chance to do much but shiver. It's been, uh, preposterous. Crikey, man, poor old you, holy boy. Do you think we can help the old fella out with a quick spell? Yeah, I'm on flipping fire. What do you do that for, you poor rat? Hang about. I ain't cold no more. I'm lovely and toasty. In fact, there's praiseworthy. Here, is this what you were after? That it is. Tidy. We'll have that. Oh, I can already stay. Let me just finish this. Some wasting MP. This place open or what? Hello, customers! Clapping heck, come on! Three people, is that you? Of course it is, you big div. You got any pieces of art handy? We need, oh, I don't know, about eight or so. Car, I might have. I'm a bit busy at the moment. Pressing flowers I am, see? Well, I would be. Only the stone I'm weighing them down with ain't flapping heavy enough. Crikey, we can't let traditional fairy any crafts like that die out, man. Don't worry, holy boy. Holy boy here's probably got just a spell to help ya.
heavy as anything it is now. That will press my flowers to perfection. This will give me something to crow about to the boys. Tom, on, you're a proper flapping legend. Let me see now, pieces of art, was it? Think there's one knocking about somewhere under here. Let's have a look. Tidy, Tom, on. Oi, oi, can we ask you something quickly? God, what is it? Oh, Drippy Boy, it's you, I'll do. Not bad, man. On your lonesome as usual, I see. Here, you've got... You've not got any pieces of art on you, have you? I know you have time for that right now, man. I can't get this uh, flipping lid open. Lid lock, eh? Wouldn't wish it on my worst enemy. Holy boy, got any spells that will pop this jar open for our friend here? Yes, it's open! Thank you, thank Flip for that! Now I can finally have a nice pickled egg! Come ah, on, I suppose I'd best give you something to say thanks, eh? Here! So you did have one! Tidy! Excuse me, can I have a word, man? Oh, oh, if it isn't the legendary Drippy! Oh, nice to see you! Stop it, you! You're making me blush! Listen, you got any pieces of art lying about? You look like the type who might have. I'm afraid I can't help who just now. I've just broken this giant jar, see? Who'd have thought I could be so clumsy? Crikey, there's unfortunate, but you're lucky we stopped by. I reckon my young buddy by here can magic it back together for you. Yahoo! It's fixed! There's lovely! Who really have been a who gel? Here, this is for who? Come on, don't mind if I do. Ta da! How do? You open? Who's that? Oh, how do? Yeah, they're open, man. Boring, but open. All right, Gary, fun face, don't die of enthusiasm. Make it quick. Anyone by here got any pieces of art we can have? Pieces of what? Nah, you got any decent food I can have? The stuff they serve here is rubbish. That's not very nice, is it? Can't blame you, mine. I've eaten my hair. Hang on, holy boy. You can whip something up with your magic, ain't it? Hey, what's this? Um, nom nom. Flip, man! This is delicious! You've restored my faith in food. Pieces of art, was it? Here you go. You deserve it. That'll do nicely. Don't go stuffing yourself silly now, will you? Tiny, that's a full complement of eight pieces of art we've put together. Let's get this care package over to Smiley and Surly. Bring the light of laughter back into their miserable lives. They're probably still moping around down by the cavity club. Let's get back there, shall we? You mean the place to the big outdoor stage? Sure, let's go. Hmm. Your first humans we've ever had stay by here. There's, um... Perfunctory. Well, it'll make a change from the usual riffraff you have cluttering up the place. But riffraff or not, their memories still fill up the old wizard's companion, ain't it? Tidy. Nice. That's what I was looking for. Morning! Morning! Did you have a pr proper tidy night's sleep? Hope so! Travel safe now!
What? Man. What? Uh. Hang on a moment, drippy boy. Is that them pieces of heart you got there? How do, boys? We got them pieces of heart for you, ain't it? Nice one, drippy boy. You're a proper legend, man. You're serious about this, is it? Making ma'am laugh, I mean. Flipping heck, man. Talk about it in the flipping deep end. Stop fretting, man. You'll be fine. Right oh boys. Get ready for those of just what the doctor ordered. Flip, man! Hadouken! Yes! What's all this then, eh? I feel weird as heck, man. Hey, though, I feel like I've woken up after a proper long sleep or something. I feel better, man. Amazing, I think. They don't seem that different. Oh, well, we're different, alright. The comic muse is in the house. We're about to bring it down around her flipping ears, man. This'll be a laugh. I know! Amazing, ain't it? That's the power of the pieces of heart, man! Proper miraculous they are! I can make a brick wall laugh! I feel so flipping funny, man! Let's flipping do this! Show me the mummy! Hold up, hold up! We need to practice first, ain't it though? Never mind jumping the gun, man! You're flipping flying over the thing! Okay, you should practice! We'll come back when you're ready! It's time for the smiley and surly show. You ready to watch a split mom's sides? The stage is set, the lights are lit. We'll crackle, we'll crack her up, you crack on in there, right? Yeah, what he said. Let's get to it, shall we? いや、いや、いや、ほんまね、夢みたいでさ、俺。うん。あ、夢と言えばね、俺ね、実はね、ずっと夢あってな。何よ、おい、唐突やな。練習。ほな、俺武器屋の親父あるから、お前リストラにあ
くにいざ準備できてますぜおお前ら乗り込むでえ乗り込むって何に行くでおかんの中にドカンと投げ込みやヘルクセフこの妖精さん、早くお願いします。早くのオーダー入りました。はい、よっしゃ、兄さん、行くでー。はいやーあ。さあ、さあ。ふう。さあ。二。一。行けばいい。ああ、ああ、ああ。ああ、ああ。ああ、ああ。ああ。Just like Kingdom Hearts, it's Monstro. This really is Alice in Wonderland, though. ここがおかんの中や<笑> The Faker Center Oh, look at the little classrooms! They're so sweet! What is <laughs> that? is what they are, isn't it? That's right, man! This is where we, br we were brought up, ain't it? Can't do that without a classroom or two to teach us the ways of the fairy world, can you? Wow, I can't wait to see what they look like inside! Esther, we have a job to do, remember? You're right. Sorry, Oliver. Okay, let's look for those littlies. Ouch. Uh, remind me why I'm doing this again. <laughs> It's 2D. Love the detail that the music is the same as the town played by a flute. This is so dumb, I love it. Yes, I understand. Hey, uh, nasty, nasty, beastie, beastie. <gasps> Mr. Drippy, look. Oh, Nick, uh, pants. If we don't do something quick, that rotter is going to make himself a little omelette. We have to save him. That's cool, isn't it? Yes. It's really funny. Almost. Well, are you okay? Tata, ta very much. Oh, he's so sweet. Oi, Lately, what happened by here anyway? Nasty, nasty, proper nasty. What's that? No, never. Well, I'll be a monkey's uncle. That's terrible. The faker center has been invaded. Horrible beasties have turned up and they've been bullying all the littlies, the rotters. That's awful, we have to help them. Please, man, please, man, please, please, please. Of course we'll help them. Goes without saying, ain't it? I'm just wondering how come beasties got in here in the first place. Well, from the ass, clearly. Could he have made it all the way to the fairy ground, Shadar? It's possible, I suppose, yeah. But if he's made it past mom... Judging by what we saw him do in that storm, I don't think getting past your mom would be much of a challenge. It doesn't matter how they got in. What matters right now is saving the Littleys. You're right, Aster. Boy, you! Stay right here, where it's safe, right? Nah, man. Wait, man. Nah, 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 nah. Wait, 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 wait. Didn't you hear him? Stay here, he said. Look at him. He, we can't just leave him here. He's terrified. We have to take him with us. 
But we're off bashing beasties, ain't it? It's not safe, man. It's not safe by right here. Scary, scary, proper scary. Ah. Don't be scared. You'll be fine. Guess it's kinda dangerous to leave him here, too, huh, Mr. Drippy? Clipping heck, man. Alright, come on then, you. We'll look after you. Yes, come along now, Lidley. Tidy, let's go. Tidy, tidy. Go, 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 go. Alright. <laughs> I'm going to take a quick break before we tackle this. But, uh, fun. <laughs> this is fun. And this is, this was very funny.
Well, I am back. <clears throat> I see someone's enjoying the music. Hey, looks like the door to the rose rooms come. What? Something. Here we are, holy boy. The tulip room. This is the violet room, holy boy. What? Did you think it was going to be purple or something? Don't tell me they got through the peach room, man. That was my flipping classroom. Criminal, that is. Trippy, man. What are you doing right here? Don't start with your chattering now, man. I'm on my break, ain't it? Actually, maybe, maybe save. Let me hear you a sec, holy boy. There's something I got to tell you. What's that, Mr. Drippy? Those steps right there are the emergency exit out of Mam's guts. We call them the back passage, see? Oh boy. The back passage? That's right, man. So if you ever need to get out of Mam's guts in a hurry, just nip up those stairs. Uh, sure, but what's to stop the Littleys doing the same? Don't be daft, man. They ain't baby steps, are they? Way too high for Littly they are. Now the back passage will take you straight to the fairy ground, so you can come and go as you please, ain't it? Um, so we could have used them to get in here in the first place? Well, yeah, I suppose, but where's the fun in that, man? Always been one for a grand entrance, me. Got my reputation to think of, ain't it? Jeez. Well, so that happened. Can't go slinking off, slinking off just yet, man. There's li still littlies to be found. Gotta hatch them all, ain't it? Squish plush fire. Oh no, another one. Quickly, Ollie boy, we gotta save those littlies. Ouchie. Eh? I did say they, the the monsters went up our ass. Clearly, it's true. Quickly, quickly! I made drippy. I think, yeah. Oh, that's the first time I noticed this happening. I can make drippy fall. Tidy, looks like the door to the tulip rooms come unlocked.
Wait, she gave me stones to evolve them, didn't she? <laughs> I I really have to say, man, the um, the monster design of this game leaves a lot to be desired. I think. Looks like the door to the, the four real rooms come unlocked. Him freak already dried all the the fountain ideas. That's not necessarily true. Every every RPG has monster monster enemies. You just can't collect them, but. Every every RPG has monsters and they're usually not this bad. Please. This is Ghibli, which normally has really cute character designs. Being Ghibli makes it more disappointing. The monkey and the butterfly and the mite. That's a big one. Blah 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 blah. Something like that. Where's that from? Yep. 
Rick and Morty. Okay. I'm here, I'm here. Tidy, 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 tidy. That's some proper good work, you what? Looks like all the Littleys are safe and sound. We sure thank goodness for that. Let's have a quick count up. One, two, three, four, five. All the Littleys are alive. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Never let them go again. There's eleven. There's a dozen. Hey, what's Bevan? He's my cousin. That's Bevan. How do, man? Wow, hey, the gang's all here. Tidy. Blimey, rhymey, tidy, tidy. Drippy, drippy, drippy. Ah, do they ever shut up? They're so annoying. How do we get rid of them? Take them to the exit, ain't it? There's a slide outside. You go down that, and the way out's just by the bottom there. Slide? Why is there a slide? It's to remind them that they can slip and slide on the banana skins of life in here. But when they get outside, the same stuff won't slide, ain't it? Typical mom, that is. She's a big fan of the old tough love. I have literally no idea what you're talking about. Are you fairies all completely mad? <laughs> I don't care what he means. I'm just looking forward to the slide. How oh, to be young and simple. And flexible. This sounds like it's going to hurt. Not long now until the Littleys are finally born. Let's take them to the exit. So... There's two exits? I can come in. What, what's the point of the stairs to go outside if we can just slide down the slide? Now all we gotta do is hop on the slide and we'll be out of mama's guts before you know it. You ready to go, holy boy? Royal jelly, bane of mom's belly. Nope, no choice. Smash a hit! What the flipping heck? There's loads of little things coming out of it, man. Mind you, it looks proper n knackered after popping that lot out. Now is your chance to give it a smack or two, holy boy.
Let me pass. Oh boy, this guy's so slow. I guess that's the first time I've used it. Good stuff. Damn ta 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 ta. Thank goodness, is everyone all right? Of course they are. These lilies are nowhere near as fragile as their egg looking. When I was their age, I ate squid for breakfast. Proud of art I was. It wasn't a jelly. F but wasn't that a jellyfish just now? What a lucky escape, though. We've never seen a sea creature so big. I thought we were finished. Well, something had to be done about it. And I suppose we were just the ones to do it, eh? There's the heroic of us. Sure, someone had to make sure the Leedleys made it out somehow, huh? Speaking of which, how do we get out of here? Yes, how do we get out of here? There's no way out. We can get back up the slide. Of course we can't. Smiles back up to the top. So, what do we do? What do you think we do, man? We got reborn, ain't it? Huh? What? Yeah, we pop out along with the Leedleys. Come on, man. You only live once. You're only supposed to be born once, do you, you demented little gnome? Just what are you suggesting? Your flipping humans are so prudish. It's like this, see? Just up beyond here is Mama's... Mom's exit. It's where the Littleys get born from, ain't it? Oh, boy. Coming out of her coochie. Good stuff. And if we pop out with them, we'll be back in the fairy ground before you know it. Besides, it's not like we've got much choice in the matter. Just pop out? Are you mad? Moppy toppy tidy righty wahi. Gee, I don't know about this. Don't worry, as long as we're together, we'll make it through somehow. Remember the eye of the storm? We survived that, didn't we? Toppy poppy, toppy poppy. 
And I guess this is it. Time to be born again. Here goes nothing, man. We'll make a quick exit. I don't want a heck of an entrance. Well, not exactly how I expected my day to go. It's a giant dick. No, she just has a coochie on the top of her head. Where's Drippy? It's getting late. Oh, it must be knackered after the day we've had. I know I am. Oh, look. There he is. Yo boys did a proper tidy job, man. Mom was laughing fit to flipping burst. The two small balls, then a body with a spherical shape. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I got it. Well, we couldn't have done it without you, Drippy boy. And pieces of art packed a real punch, ain't it though? We were on fire, man! Yeah, I suppose you would have bombed without my help, eh? Mind you, your routine, I gotta say, man. It was pretty flipping funny. Really, thanks, Streepy Boy! Took me back, it did. Back to the days when the stage was still my life. Ha! Oh, it's a tiny while ago now. Your know, gags are legendary, man. Classics they were. Our material is nothing compared to yours. I'm just chuffed we made you chuckle. He's right, man. When it comes to tickling mom's funny bone, there's there's no one ever did it quite like you, Drippy Boy. Stop it, man. You're making me blush. The time for my jokes is long gone. I won't be back on the circuit any time soon. Besides, I've got that lot to be shepherding around now, ain't it? What would they do without me? Drippy Boy. I do think about it sometimes. What would have happened, you know? I'd never gone off with Alicia, like. Wonder how far I would have gone in the old comedy game. Mr. Drippy. Oh, it's you lot, is it? What's up? You didn't hear all that, did you? Um, we, um, no, we didn't hear anything. No, we just got here, didn't we? Uh, anyway, it's late, we should get some rest. Yeah, you're right. Tidy. I'll show you to the old inn, shall I? It's a bit small for you lot, but you'll just have to grin and bear it. How am I supposed to sleep in a fairy-sized bed? I'm sure you'll manage somehow. You never seem to have much trouble falling into a deep and noisy sleep. Gee, poor Mr. Drippy. どうしたのオリバー。バックが。あら、あら。オリバー。泣いたらあかんやで。うちはな、涙の妖精っていうのやで。君、妖精だったのそうやで、妖精やで。変なことは<笑> <笑>妖精たちの言葉なのよ。そんなの変だよ。あら、どうかしら。この子母さんが作ったのよ。違うもん。僕の友達だもん。そうね。この子はあなたのお友達。どんなことがあってもね。でもそんなにメソメソして
come I ever th how can I ever thank you, Buck? Saved my life, you did. We're just happy to help, ma'am. And we're sure glad the Littleys are safe. Are you all right now? You did have a giant jellyfish inside you, after all. Oh, is that what it was? I thought it was a squid. Us fairies love a bit of seafood, see? And it looked so big and juicy, I just couldn't help myself. You mean... That's right, Buck. Swallowed it straight down, I did. What? There we were, worrying she'd been attacked by Shadar, and it was all because she's too greedy for her own good. I just had a failfish moment. Why? Look on the bright side, Swain. It means the reason was much less serious than we thought it was. I got expelled from a mountain scoochie throw. What do you want to talk about? Shadar, you say? Well, I've heard... Where have I heard that name before? Shadar? Shadar? Oh, him! That happens to me daily. Okay. You know Shadar, man? Nope. She taking the mech. Sorry, La. Of course I know him. He's that one who was flying around my head, causing all kinds of mischief. Proper little terror he is. So what happened? Smiley. Surly. Get your bottoms over by here. Oh, what a hair, what a hair. Keep your hair on, man. What is it, man? Stop flipping shouting. Can you two boys go and take a look over by Shadar's castle for me? What? Pants! Who's doing the fireplace safe puzzle? I knew the animals I needed were on the crest, but I had no idea how I could go back to the station to check. So I was convinced the clue was somewhere in the house, and I spent like an hour pixel searching for something I was convinced I was missing. You can also just go back to the um, main menu and look in the gallery. If you unlocked it in the gallery, of course. But yes. Checked my gallery, didn't see it. Uh, maybe you didn't unlock it yet? Maybe. You have to exhaust dialogue at some specific points. Uh... I think it only unlocks after you have your partner with you, if you check it with the partner. Marty McChicken himself. By the way, what did you think of the... You're definitely the Marty to my Sonny. I would shoot you in the leg, throw. <laughs> um... Did you do the... Um... The gun course? At the station? My first visit to the station? Okay. Cool, cool, cool. So other than that, game still uh, cool for you? Not bad, love. Not bad. Got like an 8k score. Trophy pop, so I assume that was it and left. Yeah, that's it. 
Nice, nice, nice. Um, I think it only gets better as it goes, to be fair. Like I said, it's slightly... Well, the story isn't anything you haven't seen before, but... The game itself makes it uh, pop out. The furries would love this game. Yeah. It's true. You've seen nothing. <laughs> You've seen nothing yet. But yes. <laughs> Dude, I am I am kind of weirded out by chickens. So, that was certainly a choice. Why? I don't know. It feels like they don't have skin. They're delicious. The, I mean, the face and the legs of the chicken weird me out. The chickens and the turkeys, they're just weird. <clears throat> not bad, love, not bad. I thought you'd lost your comic touch, but what a reaction. Found your form again, you have. There's lovely. The same part of our, of our flipping act, man. You just asked us to go to Shadar's flipping castle. What kind of reaction did you expect? What that giant dick on screen that is creeping me out? <laughs> Some mountain. We can't refuse mom though, can we? We'd best go and have a look, eh? Crikey, you don't take much convincing, do ya? Yeah, man! But think about Holy Boy in that. They helped us good, out good and proper, ain't it, though? Least we can do is return the favor. There you go, being noble again. What did I tell you about that? You can't show your mountain on stream? I'm sorry. But this one's not mine. Please, boys, for me? You wouldn't want to disappoint your dear old mom now, would you? You can say that again. We know better than to get on your bad side. Looks like we're taking a sabbatical then, eh? What's that? Splitting up, you mean? Righto, might as well, eh? How many times? We're not flipping, splitting up. I mean, we have to take a break for a bit, honestly. Thank you, Smiley. Thank you, Surly. Don't thank us. Thank ma'am. It was a flipping idea. Ta, ma'am. Anyway, we'll let Drippy Boy know if we find anything, ain't it? Thank you. Speaking of Drippy, where is he? He slipped off, ain't it? Probably gone to say bye to all the bugs and boys in town, eh? Mr. Drippy. Right, oh, you're off now, ain't you? What? Me? Uh, yeah, ma'am. We have to find the next great sage. Of course you do, love. You're a wizard, ain't it? Fancy spell or two to be going on your way with? Hmm. Oh, yeah, I guess. I mean, yes, please, ma'am. Shift shape. Change your appearance to become a perfect copy of another being. Second shelf. Create a foolproof doppelganger of yourself. <gasps> Kagebon Chin no Jitsu! Mimic. Perform uncanny impersonations upon demand. So many. Vanish. Become invisible and disappear into the shadows. So many. Become a cat and experience life as a feline. Wear cat spell. Wow! Please! More spells! Become a fish and discover the joys of life aquatic. With Steve Zizo. Reduce your body to a fraction of its size. Shrink spell. That jutsu is for a lot of clones, not just one. Did it wrong? What? No, that's Taiju Kagebunchi no Jutsu. 
Kagebunshi no Jutsu is just one shadow clone. Get out of here, you fake weave. <laughs> Open mind spell. Peek inside a person's mind and listen to the voices within. Is she giving me all the spells I don't have? Loaf of life spell. Produce a flesh a fresh loaf of bread to ward off hunger. Poison apple. Conjure an apple that drips with deadly venom. I can become the evil queen from Snow White. Wow, that's a lot of spells. <laughs> it sure is. Thank you so much, man. They're all proper useful ones, too. Well, useful to fairies, at least. Still, I'm sure there's one or two in there that you can make use of, love. We'll have a look later. We'll need to get moving. Come on, we've wasted enough time. Let's find Lantern Face and get back to the boat. You're right, we need to get back on the trail of the Great Sage. We sure do. Goodbye, man. Goodbye. Tara, my loves. Pop by any time. You know what's great? The the boat guy sent us here to find food and shelter for the crew, because they didn't have any. Then we just like, yeah, fuck them. We'll we'll hang out here. Who cares? How do my loves? What? Why can't I become a cat? I always forget what a sight it is to see old mom pop out about chivalry. Disgusting, but somehow compelling at the same time. Cares about the crew, those low life rum drinkers, excuses of sailors. Yeah. You wouldn't want to save any of the drinking people, would you? Tidy, the Lidley's got born. Ah, uh, makes you realize what's been missing around by here lately. Good old-fashioned birthday party. Hell no. Cause they'll drink your share. <laughs> predictable, predictable. Man, I'm feeling surprisingly... Um, sleepy. She's a Kunisa. <laughs> he does have a caring side after all. Hmm. Family's family, I suppose. Mr. Drippy. This is where you need to be. Shall we go? Maybe we should. This is where he belongs, after all. Yeah. It is, huh? Ah, we're releasing a Pokemon. Just like Ash. What? Get destroyed. Stabber.
Captain Sinbad. Oliver, thank goodness. Tell me that you at least found somewhere to shelter at night. We sure did. We brought a ton of food too. There's a little village on the island and... A village, say. And food also. I'm pleased to learn this. And you'll be pleased to learn that my men have completed their repairs to the ship. She's ready to sail upon your command. Shall I give the order to weigh anchor? Do you mind waiting just a little while? Forgive me, I thought you were anxious to depart. My ship and I are at your disposal. When you're ready, we sail. Yes, yes, please. Hmm. You're troubled, I feel. Have you left something behind in the forest? No. No, we're ready to go. Very well, we sail. We did the right thing, didn't we? Of course. Family is the most important thing there is. We all know that. And besides, he's no spring chicken. It's probably about time he settled down. You still got us, Oliver. The three of us can do this if we work together. I guess so. Oi! Hmm? Did you hear that? Huh? Mon, you're trying to leave without me or something? But Trippy, we thought you wanted to stay back there in the fairy ground. Who told you that, Mon? And when, exactly? I want names, dates, times. We just thought all your friends are back there. Of course they are, Mon. And they're very dear to me, even the stupid ones. But you and me, uh, we have been a team now since you were a little, and I was just a doll, ain't it, holy boy? I've been by your side through thick and thin. Remember what you said. You said I was your friend. You what are all my friends, my companions, my brothers and sisters, my family. The voices make it ten times better. <laughs> Hello, Gilly, how are you? Uh, I'm going to be sick. Shut it, you. What I mean is... You lot are stuck with me, whether you like it or not. So get that into your thick skulls, will ya? Yes, sir, Mr. Drippy. Hmm. We were only trying to be nice after we heard what you said to your friends yesterday. Oh, so it's my fault now, is it? I get it. You don't think I've been pulling my weight, is it? Fine, I'm going to start using a little trick. I know that'll blow your tiny minds. Drippy has finally got his act together and can now use the Tidy Tears ability. Hey, I can't wait to see this. Anyway, looks like the gang's all here. Shall we get back to what we're supposed to be doing? What he said to Emily and the next great sage, Otumnia, here we come. Let's go. How goes it, Gilly? How are you? The brazen presumptuousness of the Tear Fairy's heart has unlocked the story in the Wizard's Companion. The fairy who wouldn't stop crying. Mano,大津なき。ドクロメ。天変地異及ぶ古代魔法。本来世界の管理者にのみ許されているもの。あなたには過ぎた力でしたかな。予言の少年を始末するため。
自ら手を下しておきながら何の成果も上げられなかっただけではボムスこれはこれは出過ぎたマネを女王陛下奴は間違いなく魔導の力による庇護を受けておりますおそらく賢者アリシアその可能性も<笑>お前に歯向かった愚かな女現在もなお妨げとなるつもりかしかし所詮は主語の力賢者に守られるだけでは世界は救えません古代の兵器として作られし魔導王の遺産あの杖ほどの力を持たぬ限りはグラディオンかええですがご安心を彼らがそれを手にすることはありませんあるじなき魔導の杖消し去ることなどたやすいことでございましたまさかジャボードのグラディオンを消滅させたのですかええ魔導の支配を象徴する遺産だと長き眠りにつくべきなのですグラディオン我ら評議会の杖を模して人間に与えられる力だが今となっては妨げでしかないあの少年を手にすることはないのだなありえませぬ<笑>グラディオンうん Happy to be here Happy to have you Doing good Doing good Um, enjoying this game a lot. Last dungeon was especially funny. It's always a good thing. Games sometimes have a hard time of being funny. Let's see if we unlocked any side quests here, I guess. We did? A bunch? Tahiti? Where is that? I can't take it. This forest, it's just too much. 
Sparling, pull yourself together, please. What are you so frightened of all of a sudden? Hi there, is something wrong? Oh, it's you. You have to help. My husband's having yet another funny turn. I don't know what it is, but I'm petrified of traveling all of a sudden. I don't think I can carry on being a peddler if I stay like this. He seems... Yep, heartbroken. This time it's courage he's lacking. Well, there's nothing for it, I suppose. Them being old friends of ours and all, we'd best help out, eh? Courage, holy boy, that's what we need. Let's get to it. I feel brave. Whatever I was so scared of. The only thing to fear is a poor day's sails. Roll up, roll up. Thank goodness. Now we can finally get back to peddling our wares. Please don't talk about giving up peddling again. I won't, and thanks yet again. Oh, here, this is to say thank you. Please, it's the least we can do. Cheeseburgers again? Oh, I say, how jolly lovely to see you again. Who'd have thought we'd end up meeting in a rummy old place like this, hmm? It's nice to see you too, sir. How'd you wind up here? Well, I chartered myself a ship to Old Otumnia and spied this place from atop the crow's nest, as it were. Looked rather jolly, so I thought I'd take a look. And lo and behold, I find myself in a town full of fairy folk. I really ought to jot down my first impressions. What? Let's see now. Oh, oh bother. You're kidding me, right? I wish I were, old stick. But I rather seem to have mislaid my diary yet again. I really am a most insufferable blockhead. You really flipped Nar. This is the third flip in time. I rather fear it is, yes. Do you think you might be able to help a silly old sausage out this one last time? I doubt it's the last time. Sure, leave it to us. Marvelous, tell you ho, what? Tahiti ain't too big, one of decent clue should put us on the right track. No, no, let me see. I did happen across a little corker of what one might call a grotto or cave on my wanderings. Guess took the weight off the whole plates of meat with the aid of a fallen log and jotted down a few choice ponderings. Very pleasant. Cave. Never seen a cave run by here. Still. If you say so, let's go and have ourselves a goosey gander, shall we? You do know where the cave is, Drippy. We've been there. <sighs> Pants, man! Why can't I stop myself? Is something the matter? You seem kinda upset. Too right I flip in while I am. I love making people laugh, see? I've been all over doing comedy and that. Raise smiles from here to the winter isles I have. What exactly is so tragic about that? Just getting to that, ain't I? The thing is, recently, see, I just can't help coming out with jokes in completely the wrong situations. The other day I tried doing a funny when I went to visit my buddy, who's laid up sick in bed, and before that it was at this proper important meeting. Hmm, yeah, that doesn't sound too good. I can't help myself. It just comes out with whatever comes into my head. I'm there going, not now, not now, not now, but before he knows it, it just happens. I think I see the problem. Heartbroken you are. You've had your restraints stolen, ain't it? Yeah, by now. That makes sense, I suppose. Don't worry, I reckon we can help you out. What do you say, Oli boy? I don't think that was an Oli line. It said Oli, but I don't think that was his line. Tidy, don't forget now. It's restraint we need, and plenty of it. Give a hat Ah, oh, that's a proper funny feeling, that is, but nice, mind you. So, do you feel any different? Do you know what? I, I reckon I do. I don't feel like blurting out jokes willy-nilly anymore. 
Come on, you've uh, proper sorted me out. You've proper sorted me out. Here, to say thanks, like... Three bars of fairy chocolate. Chocolate is always welcome. Did I do something wrong, sir? I, uh, I'm real sorry if I offended you. Shut up, man. What are you apologizing for? It's not your fault old Zip, li Zip Lib here is refusing to open his trap, is it? Boy, you! What's your problem? Nothing personal, like, I just don't see the point in all that. How do you... How do nice weather we're having rubbish is all? Don't see the point in paying your customer the most rudimentary of courtesies? Flip, man, what kind of flipping shopkeeper are you? Calm down, Mr. Drippy. I will not... I, I will not flipping calm down. You're the disgrace to the fairy race, man. Never seen such a disgusting display in all my long years. Oh, hang about. He's probably heartbroken, ain't it? He's lost his kindness or something. You're right. He probably has, huh? Shall we help him get it back? To flipping right we shall. Me. Leave one of my fairy comrades in need? Never. One supersized portion of kindness coming up. I don't have any. Pants and flip! I'm just going to have to skip down, man. Skip down? Are you in some kind of trouble? Eh? What's it to you, big ears? We fairies don't take kindly to eavesdropping, you know? Uh, oh, sorry, Mr. Fairy, sir. I'll forget I heard anything. Nah, man, you're involved now. You'll have to help me. Huh? But I don't even know what you did. You aren't going to ask me to do something bad, are you? Don't be daft. All it is is I got and got my buddy's whole slapstick collection stolen. Stolen? Gee, how did that happen? Well, I wanted to try my hand at a spot of the old slapstick humor, see? So I uh, borrowed a few slapsticks from my buddy and went off into the woods for a bit of practice, like. And these beasties jumped me, and next thing I know, there I'm completely flipping slapstickless. If my buddy finds out, that's the end of our comedy duo. It's curtains for certain. Kiss a hand, man. There's a pal. Get all three slapsticks back from me, would you? If you can get them back in time, he'll never know I nicked her or borrowed them, ain't it? Tom, huh, man, you're an absolute lifesaver. So do you remember what kind of creature stole the slapsticks? Yeah. Wishing wembats, they were. Ran off looking proper pleased with themselves, the cheeky little blighters. Guess they must really like slapsticks, huh? They might not give them up too easily. Exactly, that's why you have to blind them first. And they won't be able to stop you taking the loot back off them once you beat them. Blind them, beat them, and bring them back all three slapsticks. Piece of cake, now get to it. Blind them? With what? I don't know if I have anything to blind them with. Phew, I feel proper rotten, man. I got the shivers and everything. You okay? You look kinda sick. You got this from jumping in the river when them littlies got born, ain't it? Bingo! That carried away, didn't I? And now... Uh, 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 Did you take some medicine? I ain't got none, have I? And I can't go foraging for ingredients in my stay. Hey, you couldn't be a pal and get them for me, could you? Come on, how you want? Don't be daft. We fairies have to stick together, ain't it? 
What are these ingredients then? Let's see now. We need a bunch of booster shots, a bundle of slumbering leaves, and a bottle of spring water. Tidy, we'll be right back. We did? Ooh, I already had the items for it. Cool. Not sure where to get the the pieces of art that I don't have. Or how to blind the bats. Doesn't the burglar have a blind shot or something? Uh, the cat? Yeah, I'll have to look. One of the trophies is to use steel with him? Okay. Like 40 or 50 times. Swain. Oh, okay. He might. Shots, mug shots. Nailed it. That was it, though. That's the ability, the mug shot. <laughs> he does not have a blind shot, though. At least... Yeah, 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 that's, that's what I was asking, if that's the... the stealing thing you were talking about. 
Hey, look. There's something on the floor here. It looks like the gentleman's diary. Mm. Reckon you're right, holy boy. Let's have a look now. Oh, pants. It's soaking wet, man. Gee, it really is, huh? Could still read it. Just about. I guess it should be okay. Do you need to do that quest later? No. What is the Golden Grove? Is there another place here that I can go in and I haven't found? I don't think so, but... Never know. Also, did you notice how she doesn't have two balls? Yeah. Sorry we took so long, we found your diary. You did? Oh, you absolute marvel, you. It's kind, it's kind of wet, will it be okay? Oh, what's a little temp between friends? Here, something for your trouble, old thing. There's four side quests pending, though. No, huh? Town, isn't it? What town? Why can't I move the cursor in the map? This looks like a great place to get my ass kicked.
Iron Man. Town. That town, which town? The fairy ground? No, well, the fairy ground is the fairy ground, no? I don't know, man. I don't see any other prompts for a side quest. Also, it says that the fairies returned to the Golden Grove. They, they were always in the fairy ground. So, I don't know. I don't know if that's it. Connecting the first area of the game with the second. Oh, okay. You looked it up? Yeah, okay. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Tidy tears. Oh, he did something. I don't know what it is, but I'm really sleepy. I napped? Mm. Everyone's not here to harass you? Maybe, maybe. How's it going, Melty?
<laughs> yeah, I'll uh, I'll keep having never watched that. Thank you. Seems like something I don't want to watch. I think I'm sticking around for much longer. Speaking of uh, Sleepy, I watched uh, Falcon and Winter Soldier. I started watching, then I went to have some sleep. Then I woke up and I continued watching. <laughs> I was just sleepy. The, the, it, it wasn't boring. Respect a possible future roster of hit game Crystal Dynamics Marvel's Avengers. I've said it before, they 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 should like um expand content with a little less effort so that they can put out stuff a little faster, they should make more clone-like characters. Just don't make a big deal out of it. But, uh... Like, a War Machine, uh, a Jane Foster Thor, a Winter Soldier, uh... Stuff like that would, like, expand the roster to double, give people more characters to level up with 
slight modifications and maybe not be that much effort. And then they can do... We'll save Iron Heart in the future of the game. They said they are bringing in Iron Heart. Or are you just saying that? I'm talking about the the, the game. The Avengers game. No, 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 no. But yeah, like, they, they promised the Spider-Man for a Sony exclusive. If they actually made this move, they could they could have Spider-Man as a PlayStation exclusive, but every platform would get Miles Morales. Like... It will never deliver. And basically... Everyone still has a Spider-Man. It's just Peter Parker that's exclusive to the, to Sony. This would be so smart. In terms of... Uh, Getting more bang for your buck in terms of the money you spent for developing. Also, welcome back, Metal. I didn't say... Welcome back. Sometimes I miss it, man. I missed a big RPG like this. I love I love playing Persona 2, but the lack of a world map um well, it, it is obviously smaller in scale. It's just a city, but it makes it feel smaller in scale. No, no, I'm not going to the forest. Obviously not. I would never go there. Who do you take me for? I'm going to sleep. That's what I'm going to do. <laughs> It's just been sorted, man. What? How's that then? Hey, how's that? 
Calm down, Mon, will you? What, Drippy Boy, is that you? When did you come back right here, then? Just now, Mon. Only boy here lifted the curse Shadar put on me, ain't it? What, this little human by here? What is it humans say again? Looks can be deceiving, is it? Anyway, Drippy Boy, I'm glad you're here. Need your help, I do. Why? What have you done now? I ain't done nothing, man. It's the forest, ain't it? Being terrorized, it is. It ain't been peaceful five minutes, and now these blinking hyperbores have come along pinching all over flipping mushrooms. But there are heaps of mushrooms in Golden Grove. I'm sure you could let them have some. What? No way, man. These monsters have got an insatiable appetite. They'll eat every fungus in the forest if we don't stop them. Hmm, sounds like a proper pickle, that does. What do you reckon, only boy? Shall we go and sort them out? Yes. Alright, we'll get rid of the monsters somehow. What? Tidy! Um, you do know they're proper nasty, don't you? Don't worry, man. Holy boy will be fine. You'll have the Lord High Lord of the Fairies with him, won't he? Trippy man, you're a hell of a brave. Ta, boy buck. Now, I heard there's three of those hyperbores all together. We're counting on you, ain't it? Also, I love that Oliver's mom was like, ah, da, da, when he was uh, crying. Board? It's not just one, huh? Two to go. Gunter. <laughs> 
Holy shit. Three? Damn, that was pretty good. sure why but um, I'm gonna stop here for today by the way do you think it would be interesting if I uh, try to convince my dad to play a way out with me On the channel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just not sure when. That's probably the bigger question. When? My dad's always working. I like it, but yeah, I don't know. Also, he's not great at English. Let's see if I'm getting destroyed. Probably. to me seemed harder it's probably what the game is on normal mode just so I'm finally playing on normal mode
Metal wants me to not play on easy, but doesn't want me to go on the hard places. When you wanted to go there? Yep. You would be destroyed. I won the first fight though. Must have been a shit fight because it felt easier than these ones. But I'm about to die. Ouch. Rest in force. You wish. No resting in force here. Try to fight me, man. Let me explore the place. I feel like there has to be something. Capture the new enemies, huh? Fire fry or flash fry? This one actually kind of might be cool. Nope, still has a fucking diaper for some reason. Back on the main area? Not main area, first area, yeah.
I wanted to see how I would do against these enemies now. Also, I'm really sleepy and I was going to turn it off, but... You know how it is. Video games. You never really want to turn them off. You guys are kicking your ass, you bet. Stop it with the sleeping spells. Oh my god. Rest in force. I don't know, man. I have full health. I don't think so. Sorry to disappoint. But no. Let me go in here and heal. Speak with the tree. Damn, I didn't capture a single familiar there. Yeah, the great Deku tree. It's right here. Hello, old Father Oak. Oh, here you are again. Oh, very nice to see you. How goes your journey? Hmm? Tell me about it. Oh, so you returned to the place of your birth, at last. Drippy. And did your friends have to drag you there, I wonder? Mr. Drippy's mom is as big as a mountain. Why, she's even bigger than you, old Father Oak. Told you already, shut up about my flipping mom. I'm a battle-hardened warrior, not some mummy's boy, got it? Sure, I'm sorry, because we have to try and be strong or we'll never beat Shadar, right? Do not place much importance on strength, Oliver. Though your path may lead to conflict, you travel in the name of friendship and love. You must be kind to all those you meet on your journey. You never know how they might be able to help you. And above all, you must be kind to your companions. As long as they are beside you, no obstacle is insurmountable. Sure will, old Father Oak. Handsome reply as ever. Now let me offer you some help of my own. Medal of Dexterity. Cool. Thank you very much, old Father Oak. We should keep on trying my hardest. A brave boy, an honest, never lose that purity of heart. Start of the Link's Awakening remake on the Switch since you asked what I've been playing hours ago. <laughs> I did, yes! Love the original Link's Awakening, my first Zelda, my first Game Boy game. Um, it was also my first Zelda, not my first Game Boy game. But I, I really love that game, yeah. I assume you played the original, Cyan?
You haven't? Oh man, you're in for a treat, huh? I actually haven't played any of the mobile Zelda games. Um, yeah, I have... Um, I played Link's Awakening an oracle of ages and seasons, but they didn't finish any of those. Didn't finish the oracles? No. I got a little annoyed, to be fair. To be honest. Um... Because you have to replay them. With the password. You have to replay them with the passwords after you've already beaten them once. It's like, really? I have... I have other games that I want to play, man. Not necessary. There's a different... Uh, playthrough with a password for beating the previous one, right? Well, you can look up the password, I guess. Play through? Yeah, no? What is that? 60 GB Switcher 3 game? Is that still a playthrough? It's still a playthrough, even if it's short. Did I save? What do you call a playthrough of a short game? A playthrough. Not sure the first time you play it. I don't think so either. There is something here. I know all. I know why stars appear. I know why moon is eaten. I tell you a good thing. Go east. East of forest. Find land of cats. Did I not tell you? I know all. Here once fairies play. We laugh so much, now fairies go, now no laugh. What I'm saying is the password won't change nothing special for you to stop playing the Oracle games. Well, means I need to beat them again to get the real ending. Tell me, red-haired boy, you know curry, I want to eat.
Is that not a green chest? At least I got one. Wonder what level he starts at. East of the forest is the land of the cats? How do I get there, though? Got some nice battles in though, at least. Also, we got our first uh, level 3 uh, familiar, right? Stage 3. So, all in all, pretty good. Let's save, and, uh, and that's gonna be it for today, because I'm really, really sleepy. 
Um, but yeah, we'll be back tomorrow with more Nino Kuni. Uh, rest in force. Yeah, thank you guys. Thank you for watching. Thank you for hanging out. And um, yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Goodbye.